But then what do we do? Do we just do we all decide to take a pirate radio station and start blaring the truth from loudspeakers? No, because we're well. What we'd be doing is we're just inferring you know, uh, another you know another version of ideology onto people, right? Because that, that's the problem, right? To get to the pure, if you wanted to get to the pure thing, you'd have to be you'd have to be you know and that's what you'd enter into shamanism. You would enter into you know schizophrenia. You would have to you would have to crack. This in reality, you have to see, to see behind the veil. So then, how do we, how do we stop the Mad Max underdog? Well, that become, you don't. You know? That's not the point. Because we, we, ultimately, that leads in like a, a road type scenario. Right now. Well, because ultimately, reality doesn't matter because reality we adapt to whatever reality we're in, whatever environment we're in, we adapt to. Right? That's the, that's what human beings do. It, it's our salvation and it's our curse. Right? Because if, if, yeah, because you don't always want to adapt because some realities are just more. So right, then, you want to like keep from, you know, like ad- adapting. Adapting means that you you become. Yeah, because people uh, adapt to street, prison right? camps all the time. Yeah, exactly. Yeah, it's exactly right. You don't want yeah, people. You actually have to become irrational. Human beings have to be irrational in order to be human. But, or else, what's the difference between us and a computer? Right, a computer thinks logically. Right. But like a human being will think irrationally, illogically. Yeah, we'll that that, that is what the theme of Star Trek was, right? Problem. It's like, but you know, that's why Spock, is Spock was such an important figure in the show, because he's like, well, that's, not, that's illogical. It's like, well, to be a human, you have to be a little bit illogical, um, right? That was the point. The human experience is, like, when everything is pointing, you know, go this way. This is the way to safety, and you're like... And and yet, go this computers way. common, and yet, the computers most common problems. They're fantasy, they're living, the they're result fantasy, of small living, logic, you know. They're right. Fantasy, they're well, in order for a system to function, there has to be some kind of input the logic. There has, be, there has to be something that, that like nothing. You can't be. You can either be consistent or correct. You can't be both at the same time. So like that, that's like when you measure the speed of light. In the moment you measure the speed of light, that's what the speed of light is. However, it's a it's a varies over time, right? There's a it, it, it's never the same thing twice, right? It's, it's not hard. And we just decided through like like it's it's like that uh, the observation principle that it, by observing something change the nature of what you yeah, that's exactly what it is. Yeah. And on a quantum, like we, we experience this on, a, on the quantum level, right? Like, once you get past, you know, certain, you know, uh, microscopic structures, you, you find that there's there's another level, another veil, another veil, and you keep going down this, um, you know, like, like telegraphic. Uh, spiral yeah. that well, goes yeah. down, no, and when you get to the, like not when you start to get down deep in it. through it, well, you start to realize that the distinction there. between uh, <laughs> electrons, between <laughs> matter, <laughs> between everything, <laughs> the distinctions break down, and everything <laughs> becomes this like uh, what <laughs> David Baum, uh, and, and, David Baum you know, described as the right? undivided wholeness in flowing motion, flowing movement. So like it's one big sea of of just flux. Right, and flux and counter flux and changes, right? And that physical matter is, is more like like a vortex on that stream, right? Where like it's flowing, right? But it appears as a solid object, right? That that uh, sink like a that I mean, it's, it's, it's that those, that no one those whole, like, uh, yeah, you know, yeah. yeah. like, it, it looks like it's, you know, it's, 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 it's an object, right? But it's really just a, uh, a kind of yeah. a habitual pattern what is real within the flowing what motion, but it's constantly flowing, right? With so, so nothing is, nothing is exactly contained, whole, like, Newtonian, you know, Cartesian concept of the reality. Reality is, is never changing the flowing motion, more like, like the Taoist concept of, you know, the Tao, this, this, this yeah. energy is yeah. flowing energy that permeates through everything, that constitutes everything, and, and nothing which is the same thing. So, so, so it, 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 everything starts to break down once you get to a certain level. So are we all just screwed up or not? You actually have to become dualist, right? It, yeah, because you don't religion, always want to actually yeah. dualism. No, so the problem with dualism is that dualism makes you believe that 
one side can win over the other. And all that uh, uh, right. Uh, and and it's the yin yang of Taoist idea that those two opposites are actually one. They're co codependent. They're dependent on each other. But you cannot have light without dark. Because how would you define what light is? How would you define what dark is? And that's what it is. The two, right? They, they exist together as one. So like, and, and it, it goes with. You know, so has or you know, they come together as one. You know, that's why the basic becomes the basis of symbol. So it's never, you know, it's never never straightforward. Is you know, good must triumph over evil, because evil evil will always be good because good is dumb, right? No, they, they need each other. You can't define something as good without evil. Like, you need those two concepts. But they're, they're the complementary. One, the one who wins the deadliest warrior. It's true. Yeah. It's true. Perfect thing is on that game. Just think about that. Constant. Ballistic knife. Right. Two horrible things together. You can use it as a knife. But you can also shoot. You can shoot a knife. Could it cut through those three medicine balls? Of blood. Didn't, blood. didn't Snake Eyes and G.I. Joe right. like a device like that? Something I don't like know, but that just sounds. This is how I'm calling it. Yeah. You know, that sounds like it breaks like a Geneva connection. Still, still in theory. Every culture has a realistic reality. Like, that's not fair. Yeah, yeah that's a knife. Yeah, yeah, yeah vacuum Because it's exactly. a, it doesn't even, it's still the only noise in here is the initial power. It's hyper-subjective being represented by something else. Like, it's supposed to function, right? Oh, God. It's kind of like, like, all of history can be combined. You actually have to be calm. You actually have to be calm. <laughs>